Red line blinking. <laughs> Victims. Here we go. Inspired by Fifty Shades of Grey, it's Mother's Day, and this guy beat my bunkers last week. It's time for a new game. It's called s and Lowball. Here's how it works. I told you the order. You're going to grab this yellow ball right here, or one or the other, not this pink ball, because it's too good. The bumpers are up, and you need to throw your ball on this lane in the least amount of pins as you possibly can. For every single pin you knock down, you get a rubber band. We put that rubber band on your wrist. At the end, the winner gets to pull those rubber bands and snap each and every one of them on your arm. s and The person with the least rubber bands wins $50. Are we clear? <laughs> yeah, I have a lot of free time. All right, so who was first? Show us how it's done. The lowest you possibly can do. Any one of those two yellow balls. Are you in charge? Here you go. I don't care. However, you can get the least amount of pins because I'm going to need a rubber band for every single pin. You think that's good, but that's down the middle. Yeah. Five. One. Two. Three. Four, five. Put them on. Next. Cindy. Cindy. And one of these yellow balls. They're both seven pounds. And here come all the ten pins. The least amount possible. Yes, you can get a gutter. It's just not too easy. Lowest amount wins $50. Everybody else gets the wristband snap on the wrist. Using the bumpers, probably not the best idea, but this ball's got potential. Three, three, yes. Come here and get your three rubber bands. Next. Marlene. We're going to go fairly, so at one o'clock, if we just started a round of everybody, we'll finish that round, and we'll get going until that round is done, and then we'll decide who the winner is. If one o'clock comes and we're at the end, what up? Here we go. Marlene, the least you can do. I feel a strike coming. It's good form. I don't know. One bumper. Go uh, get five. Yep, there's five. So our leader is at three right now. Three, two,
And it's looking straight at the gutter, and now it's turning center. So we know the lane slants to the center. If you're not dead on the bumper, that is a seven. Come on, Randy. It's a seven. Tommy's up. Tommy's looking to break three digits by the end of this contest. He wants to show every lady here tonight who the real man is. And only real men wear vests. Decent. You thought it was good, but it tripped down to four. It was decent. Here's three. And four. You shouldn't turn your back on it. You would have only had a one. Who's after Tommy? The leader with only one. Sets up to the plate. Looking for the home run in baseball and score. And bowling is a strike. No? Oh, I'm sorry. Here she goes. What do you think? She can do it again? Or less? Well, they didn't win the pitcher of beer, so she's got to be sober. Slowly. Trying the other side of the lane. Notice how the bumper's all wiggly all the way down. Therefore, you're going for three. Four. Three is. She's up to four. Next. I wish I had a secretary that could just lay rubber bands out. Alex! Captain Gutterball. Oh, 
Oh, you're hers, okay. All I saw was a person walking away. I don't know who you're here for. We have a substitute. Sure wants. Captain Gutterball's fiance heads in for the strike. Cuts back right and gets a one. Good substitution. Here you go. What's your name? Cindy. Cindy. All right, anyone who got their picks to click, who's going to take this one down? Four is the lead, but Cindy's got the ball. All the way. Everybody heads outside. The sun will be coming out before this ball meets the boots, but... Just makes the buzz harder, doesn't it? Man. If it stops, what do we do? Do we give her 10 pins or zero? I heard a 10. Hold on. Two, three, four. You think slow would do it, but literally it just hits more pins somehow. I don't know. Marlene! With an M. Alright, next time someone strikes, they have to do 20 push ups also. It's crazy. The worst thing I can do to you is hit you with my whip six times. No, it's not. I saw it. I bought that bad boy. I didn't even know it was going to be a trilogy. I'm like, what? That's no. See, she didn't even threaten it yet. So here we are, down on lane 20, and we're going to give the mid-game interview with this ball because I've got that kind of time. Seven pounder, how are you doing tonight? I swear I fixed anything I did and slowed it down by a mile. I'll make it back before it hits the pin still. How's it going? Is it working? Yes! No, I'm not going to interview everyone's ball. That's just the mood. Here you go! Nothing! She was coming for it, too. All right. Who's next? But by chance, how many do you have that I just saved you from? Enough! Okay, I can see. Never mind. Don't worry about her. What's your name, miss? Thomas. You shouldn't have answered if you didn't want me to call you miss. Kids these days. Taylor? Tammy. Tammy. Five? Yes. Ugh, boy. Kids these days. You might get old enough to know what S and M stands for. Saturday Makeout! Here's our leader. Everyone boo at the same time. One, two, three, go. Very nice. She gives you that I'm going to tell my mommy look. Did Fifty Shades of Grey actually do that bad at the box office that they released early, or was it all planned for Mother's Day? Did anyone know? I think they planned it for Mother's Day, this makes sense. Another one, three, four, five. The most she's gotten thus far. Who's next? Marco forgot he was even in the contest. 
Panthers sweeping. Marco, throw the ball as hard as you can to see how less spins you get. Alright, you didn't miss him, that's good. Pretty good though. Seven. Four. Two. And one. I think I've given out a different combination to get every number. Rigo! Right? Rigo? I'm like the worst gamer ever, and like, they give me a microphone to call your names all night. <laughs> My real name is Greg, but I wear a vest that says the rock on it. Matt's my middle name. The Matt Rob. That's crossing the lane. That's crossing the lane. One bumper. Nice. Use the whole lane. Magic pie. J. Next she'll be a U because that's half of a J. Leapfrog. All right, we're gonna do leapfrog after this. And then Red Rover. Good news is the pins will be standing before it gets there. I'm changing my name to Jay. Chuck it, 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 chuck it. Hey everyone else, you have approximately seven minutes left in Cosmic Bowl 1, 2, 3, 4. If you want them all. Whatever floats your boat and straps you to a hole. What? Next. Looks like we're gonna make at least one more round. Probably two more rounds. Who's got over ten? Whenever you're ready, you won't stop it. Remember, the loser goes home with me. There's a girl. Yeah, it took him three tries. You forgot your rubber band. Man, you should start getting negative for gutter balls. Who's first? Encarnacion. I forgot the whole name. What is it? Enocencia. Garcia Para. I love all these long names. They're fun for me. The Substitute. Good movie. Bad people. Ooh, five. Yes. Is it Eno or I know? Eno. Eno Middle name is Red. See who's next. Steve. Cindy. There's conga drums in the background. Cindy. She's gonna write her diary entry tonight before the ball gets there. There was this guy at the bowling alley. He kept talking and talking and talking and talking and talking, and then my ball finally made it. But he didn't stop talking and talking and talking and talking, and everyone that didn't play the final game of the night went home, but I was still there waiting for my ball. So we waited and waited and waited. Tortured us the whole game for a zero! Oh wow. Let's hear for Sydney torturing everybody without getting any pins. Next. Marlene! I have an Aunt Juanita. Do I look like that kind of person? Do I look like I have an Aunt Juanita? Is that weird? Country folk. I'm running out of things to say. These balls are taking forever to reach these pins. Or not reach these pins, Cindy. Four minutes left for the rest of you. Four minutes. Alright, we'll go back to the diary entry, apparently. They're going to share diary entries as they hold hands and talk about the night. Somebody sat down on the bar and started shaking his legs. And it was like the most romantic thing I'd ever seen in my life. And then he just caressed the inner thigh. What? This might not even make it. Well, we only have one more ball. 
<laughs> and the next person has to throw with the ball in the lane. Therefore, they hit the ball and hit more pins with the other ball. Yeah, that's going to be about where it's going to stop. It might keep going and come back, but that's about where it's stopping. It's still moving forward. Let's see if the sweep can catch it. Come on, sweep. You thought it was hitting pins, but it turned sideways and dropped in the gutter. That is one heck of a diary entry. We double cutter in a row. Who's next? Deborah Thomas Conveyor Belt. That's his full name. Does anyone know why they don't make bowling lanes downhill? Because working in a bowling alley is the worst thing you could do. Gator from the Gator. Yeah, one, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, seven, eight. Who's next? Our leader at four? So you're at ten? Where have I been? Oh, I know, I fell asleep twice in a row over here. Alright, here we go. That's good speed. Looks like it wants to go left, but it might just hang out there. Running down the second arrow, cutting out to the first. That's going to guarantee you three pins if it doesn't touch a bumper again. That's going into the pocket. That's looking like a winner. That's looking like a loser. That's looking like a gutter. Now a one. See, that's not commentating. It should be on television. That's my name. A L E Alexander. Alexander Gutterball. He's been here 27 pounds makes in a row. Porter to lane 32 for ball retrieval. Might be 33. Yeah, double ballage. And now there's another one stuck. Smart. Captain gutter ball. Captain double bounce. Eight. <laughs> Was that the tears of a clown? Fear Fest? What does clowns have to do with Halloween? <laughs> Tell me, what what does clowns have to do with Halloween? Don't get stopped by it. What happened to Halloween this Halloween, October the 31st? No, you don't know. Fear Fest is okay. Start counting your rubber bands. 
Do a hippity hop? Come on, you. It's lowercase u, so technically it's uh.